Hey guys, Gaming Smoke here, back again for another Marvel Battle Lines video. Today I wanted to talk about the sneak peek notice that was added on the forum. So if you didn't know, there's going to be an update this week. So on uh, the 24th of January or January 24th, this Thursday, they're going to make a little update to the game. So here they just talk about the sneak peek. There's going to be some changes to challenge mode. There's also going to be some new cards added to the game as well as improvements to the guild. So one of the new cards that is going to be added is this Black Panther variant card. So it looks pretty good. I like the art in it, but I'm curious about the second image here. Like, what is this? Is this going to be a special ability or is it going to be a separate card? The difference is, if you can notice, the actual costume is slightly different. And also, his um, accents on the costume are gold in the picture here on the right, whereas the one on the left is all silver. So that is quite interesting. I'm very curious to see what he does. As like I said, I'm a pretty big Black Panther fan, so I'm definitely looking forward to seeing that card. Also, there's going to be a change by adding daily rewards for challenge and competitive arena. So that is something that is pretty good. It does make playing those modes a bit more worthwhile. And it says here that rewards will be sent to the mailbox at 12 a.m. daily according to the tier that you achieve. So that could be something good. Hopefully they don't give us common and uncommon cards because no one wants those. My worst <laughs> fear is actually opening up card packs and getting common and uncommon cards. What a waste, especially if the cards you can get from spe uh, special ops and they can be farmed pretty easily. So that is pretty much a waste. <laughs> They also said here that there's going to be an update to the guild. As of right now, the guild doesn't really serve too much of a purpose. You can share cards that go up from um, common, uncommon, but you can't share any rare cards and definitely no epic cards at the moment. So apart from that, there isn't really anything else to do. The guilds do have levels, but the problem is with the levels, they again, they serve no purpose. So they're just there for the sake of being there. So hopefully with the change that is coming, they're going to make things a little better. Also, number four is definitely something I'm interested in because it just annoys me sometimes having to use skip tickets one at a time, especially when I'm trying to get one specific card. I literally and I have like 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 tickets and I got to do one at a time. Just allow us to do like multiples. In this case, 10, which is something that is pretty good and is a nice change to the game. So those are a few of the changes that are coming this Thursday. Unfortunately, they haven't given us too much information as to what is coming or what else is coming, but this is just something for now. Like I said, I'm really looking forward to this new Black Panther card and I'm very looking, very much looking forward to seeing what he can actually do in the game. One other thing I wanted to talk about is this here that was added yesterday. So arena tier and rewards renewal. So what they basically said is they're going to make a change from or change to the tiers of arena and competitive arena. So right now the normal arena tiers go from one to eight, but what they actually do is going to make that one to six. So anyone that gets to arena six is going to be promoted to competitive arena. So if you're already in six, seven, eight, you're automatically going to be promoted to competitive arena which is kind of crazy actually and also you will be getting rewards automatically for being in these arena tiers so arena eight seven six so for arena six you're going to get uh, the arena eight promotion reward which is an epic card plus two thousand gold the arena seven you get again arena eight promotion one epic card two thousand gold plus competitive arena promotion reward epic card times two plus four thousand five hundred gold okay that's interesting but arena eight Competitive Arena Promotional Award Epic Card times one and 2,500 gold. So that is something a bit interesting to me. Are they saying basically if you're in Arena 7, you can literally get three Epic Cards? That is very interesting, but only if you're in Arena 8, you get one Epic Card. Uh, I wonder if I lose a few games on purpose and get back down to Arena 7, will I be able to get the three epic or when potentially two epic cards because i already got my first epic card for getting to arena eight so that is very interesting i'm definitely going to try that out because i've got nothing to lose to be honest as we're all being promoted to competitive arena also the arena awards or tier promotion awards have changed um so here arena six as i said you basically get the arena eight promotion reward which is one epic card but you also get thanos as standard and competitive arena everyone's going to get one epic card when you get to that stage so that is pretty interesting okay so this should be coming this thursday the 24th along with the other black panther stuff it doesn't actually say here when it's coming but i believe 
okay it says update at the end of january so i do believe it is the one on thursday so let me know guys are you guys looking forward to the new updates to the game i know everyone really wants death to be updated and like nerfed maybe potentially a spider-man leader they want him nerfed as well because right now they're these guys are a bit too op with that combination of hulkbuster death spider-man magus all of them together is is, is crazy I know HFS World is kind of saying she put out a video just basically asking Nexon and Marvel Battle Lines for help because this is just a joke. But yeah, I don't really play Arena too much. So for me, it's not really that big of an issue. But I um, am looking forward to the changes coming up and I hope the extra details they release will be even better. All right. So I hope you enjoyed this quick little news update. If you did like the video, feel free to like, comment, and hopefully subscribe. And if you want to see more videos like this, just talking about the updates and general thoughts of the game, just let me know in the comment section below. And also, if you want to, feel free to join me on Discord. The link is in the description below. Thanks again, guys, and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Take care. Bye.